Um, all right. So once again, thank you so much for being here today in the Millionaire School. As I said before, I'm going to be sharing with us two things within 30 minutes. The meeting is meant to last just for 30 minutes, so it's going to be always a packed up training. Now, our Millionaire School, uh, it's important for you to take note that Millionaire School these days is now by 9.30. Anytime I'm having a Millionaire School, sorry. It's going to be at 9.30 a.m. 9.30 a.m. to 9 uh, to 10.05. Okay, 30 to 5 minutes maximum the meeting is closed because I want to make sure that um, we don't spend too much time. But at the same time, the little time we're going to spend, we're going to have great information passed across to us. So make sure you have the middle school notes handy. All right. So number one I want to share with you today is the need for personal development. Each and every one of us here wants to succeed greatly in the industry of network marketing. But you forget one thing. You forget one thing. A lot of you focus so much on how much you want to earn, the house you want to build, the car you want to ride, the holidays you want to travel, you want to go, the exotic holidays. You want to experience a wonderful life. Now, that's wonderful. That's wonderful. Some of you, you, don't, you are not just in a place of um, desire. Okay, you've, you've stepped it up to set goals. You tell yourself, I am going to be achieving so, 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 and so, and so, so time. Okay, quickly, I want to share with you what I call the five levels of desire. And at that point in time, I'm on the fifth one, when I get to the fifth one, I am going to be linking it up to the need for personal development. Now, I'm going to share with you again, what well, as I said before, five levels of desire. The first level of desire as mentor, as my mentor taught me, is what I call the level of wishes and wants. All of us yesterday now listening today, we are all here because we want to achieve great success in the industry of network marketing. Now, to some of us, it's just a mere wish. I want to make it. I want to, I want, I want to. Now, how do you prove that you are just on the basic level of desire called wishes and wants? Is this very simple? The things you said you're going to do, few seconds after, few minutes after, some of you, few days after, you can't lay your hands again on it. You've forgotten everything. You only remember the things you want to accomplish when you are in the meeting. That's what happens to you. Some people here are not connected with their video. Okay, okay, Madam Rufkatu, you are connected now. So to some of you, it's only when you want to, it's, it's only when you are in the meeting that you remember, yeah, yes, 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 I'm supposed to prospect. Oh, I'm meant to invite. Oh, I'm meant to present the business. Oh, I'm meant to follow up. Oh, I'm meant to call some people and handle some of their problems and their challenges and blah, 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 blah. Oh, I'm meant to call my downline. I'm meant to call my success line. Oh, I'm meant to do this. I'm meant to do that. It's only when you come to meetings that you remember to do those things. You are just at the basic level of desire. We call it the level of what? Wishes are one. You don't accomplish anything by just mere wishing. Always remember that. Never. Never. My mentor talked to me and he said, the proof of a man's desire is his pursuits. Show me what you're pursuing, then I can show you what you, I can tell you what you truly desire. So how many of you here listening to me tonight, this morning, desire great success in your network marketing business? Let me see you have your hand. You desire great success. Let me see wave your hand if you desire great success. Someone is having some issues with, uh, with our sound, okay? Let me call her up, okay? Because I know her in person. Let me call her up. I know her in person. She's having issues, serious issues with her, with her sound. I can see her trying to connect the sound. Let me see if I can. Let me see if I can help her out. Okay, she's a new person. If you have someone new that is having difficulty connecting to the meeting, you can call the person and help the person connect to the meeting with the sound. Okay, because if they are there and they can't hear us, it's very very frustrating. It can be very frustrating. Let me see if she will connect now. She's connecting now. Let me see. Let 
think our network is disconnecting and connecting her back. Let me see. Calling her. Hello, Madam Rifkatu. Yes, you're having issues with your sound. I can see you from the from the screen. Type on type on the sound, type, type on the microphone um stuff there. Tap on it, okay? When you tap on it, you leave it. It will connect you to the sound. Yeah, you I think you are double tapping. Tap on it and leave it. All right. Okay, I can see Mr. Yuba connecting. All right, so as I was sharing earlier, if you are the level of wishes and want, you will not achieve great success in our business. Now, the second level of desire is what I call expectation. You can write it down. Please always remember that at the end of my millionaire school, I always ask questions. It's expectation. A lot of you expect something great in your business. You expect your team to grow. You expect you know, people to be joining your business and your team growing, products being used and... You know, you expect a lot of momentum. Expectation on its own will not give you the desired success. Expectation is nice. Wake up in the morning and expect something great. But if you're not ready to work towards making what you expect a reality, nothing changes. Now, the third level of design is what I call passion. A lot of people are so passionate about their business. They can talk. How this business is a wonderful one. Is that this, is this, is this, is this. And that's where it all ends. They don't sit down to learn what it takes to grow the business. Now, the fourth level of desire is what I call willingness. And this is where you start taking some steps. When it comes to willingness, you're talking about being willing to pay the price. Because for every price, there is a price to pay. A lot of people sit back and they say, oh, Mr. Noni, I want to earn like you. I want to be, I want to be among the top earners in Nigeria just like you. I want to earn hundreds of millions. I want to travel around the world like you. I want to have a nice time. I want to have great cars. I want to have properties. I want to have thousands of people in my organization. Everybody will always admire great success, but few are willing to pay the price. So the question I've got for you this morning is this. Are you willing to count the cost? Because for every price, there is a price to pay. Listen carefully. Beware of sitting down and wishing for greatness when you're not ready to pay the price for greatness. Beware. Yes, beware. Beware. Solomon says, King Solomon said, hope deferred makes the heart sick. When you keep hoping, I hope to become successful in this business. I hope to be this. I hope to achieve this. And you're not willing to pay the price. You will get sick over time. You are a human being. Don't think you can give up on this business. You can give up. You're a human being. You have an elastic, you, ha you have a limit. Your expectation has a limit. Don't ever think you can give up on anything. It's a lie. You're a human being. Even God can give up on something. So don't even think you can give up. You can give up. But that understanding should put you in a place where you should work against giving up. And how do you work against giving up? Don't sit down and wish for great things to happen to your network marketing business. Pay the price. Be willing to come the cost. Mr. Noni, I want to know, what will it cost me? Knowledge-wise and action-wise, what will it cost me? To be able to recruit 30 persons in 90 days. Because that's our next project. Recruiting directly 30 persons in 90 days. Mr. Noni, I want to be among the millionaire earners. What will it cost me? In terms of learning, in terms of knowledge acquisition, in terms of action, what will it cost me to have a team of 1,000 persons before the end of this year? Don't forget, it starts with a desire. It starts with a desire. Those of you that were with me in Yola last weekend, I asked you a simple question. What is it that you want to achieve? That's where it all starts from. But once you are clear of what you want to achieve, ask yourself, what will it cost me? There's something I got in my personal development trainings. I call it goal metrics. What will it cost you? Do you know the metrics? Do you know what it will cost you for you to achieve your goals? It gets you emotionally and mentally prepared. Emotionally, physically, spiritually, and mentally prepared to face the battle. 
Then the last level of desire is what I call dedication. The fourth one is called willingness, counting the cost. The fifth one is called dedication. Anything you want to, any, any great thing you want to accomplish or you want to achieve, you must be dedicated. Now, proof of dedication is sacrifice of what? Number one, time, which is your life. Number two, resources. Are you willing to spend money? So I can't connect to the middle next because I don't have data. You're not ready for success. Never you forget what I always teach you. If you keep doing what you've been doing, you keep getting what you've been getting. You want to make a progress in your career. You want to grow in your career. You want to grow in your business. And you're not willing to spend time to develop yourself. You're not willing to work towards growing your career. You're not willing to go for that special training, to go for that special uh, 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 professional training, or you're not willing to go for that professional uh, uh, certification that will grant you your desired promotion. Then you're not willing to be promoted yet. You're not willing to spend time to learn. So proof of dedication is what sacrifice of what time. Your time is your life. And number two, your money. Mr. Noni, I want to earn millions this year. Are you willing to spend money in order to earn millions this year? Mr. Noni, I want to earn millions this year. Are you willing to spend time to learn and to do what it takes to earn millions this year? I always teach and say, where you are right now is a reflection of who you are. The amount of money you are earning right now is a reflection of who you are. And I always teach and say, if you're not earning in millions, trust me, you can't earn millions being the same person. You have to become first before you can what? Half. Are you ready to become? That is why millionaire school every morning, 9, 30 a.m., is not meant to be optional. It's compulsory if you take your financial life seriously this year, 2024. It's not optional. It's compulsory. So back to the need of personal development. You want to be a great leader. You want to have a lot of people recruited. You want to be a leader of great leaders. Now, it all boils down to you. Success in anything you want to do. Anything you are involved in. Mr. Dauda, are you paying attention or are you discussing with your friend, Mr. Dauda? I think millionaire school is supposed to be a place where we're supposed to be what paying attention. Yes. I don't think you should be discussing with your friend. Your friend should pay attention alongside with you. Yes. All of us here, we want to succeed this year. That I know. But are you aware that success starts with you? Success is who you are. If there is anything I want you to live here with, I keep reminding you in all my meetings. You can have a new reality financially. You can have a new reality in your business, in your career, with the same personality. You must change. You must commit to daily personal development. It is not optional. Make it sacrosanct. Every day I must grow. Growth is by choice. You don't grow by accident. You must intentionally grow. You must intentionally identify the areas where you want to grow. And make consistent or take consistent steps towards growing. Everything you want to acquire, everything you want to achieve is all dependent on how far you can grow. People look at me today, they admire the kind of person I am today. I am still growing. That is the level I've achieved. But remember, 10 years ago, 7 years ago, if I met me, maybe you wouldn't like me. Because I wasn't the same person. The way I communicate, I wasn't communicating this way 7, 10 years ago. Yes. The way I do business, I wasn't doing business this way 7, 10 years ago. Never. I have to grow. Now the question is this, are you willing to grow? In the millionaire school, in our team, I'm going to be giving you materials to read. You can give excuses why you wouldn't read those materials. You can give excuses. They are all wonderful. Why you won't go through those videos? You can. 
You can give me excuses why you can't attend the millionaire school 9.30, just 30 minutes training, 9.30 to 10.05. You can give excuses why you can't be there. It is your choice. I always teach, excuses don't exist. Men make excuses. Excuses for me are just logical reasons why that people give up to explain themselves out of their laziness. Life is lived by priority. Anything you prioritize, you give time to. You make time for things you prioritize. You make time for things you value. If you truly value your financial life, the growth of your business this year, you will make time for it to grow. Mr. Nosoy, it's not, it's not that I don't want to. No, 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 no. Stop saying those things. Settle down for the job you already have and be any peanuts. Settle down for the life you already have. Why desire for growth financially when you're not willing to pay the price for growth? That's what it takes. I read books. I study. Today, I spent two hours, 30 minutes, listening to training tapes, listening to audio books, writing down, jotting. Took my bath. 8 a.m. in the morning, I headed for gym. I went and did exercise. I gymed for complete one hour. Came back. You know why? That is the price I have to pay. I need to keep my mind sharp. I need to keep my body in shape all the time. For me to be able to operate what? At this level. Do you know what it takes to operate at this level? There was a time in my life where my health was deteriorating. A friend of mine called me and said, Mr. Nonso, you work so hard. You have to start exercising. Else you will develop some dangerous health challenges that you, even, you can't even handle. Start taking care of your health. Watch what you eat. Stop eating too much sugar. Stop eating this. Stop eating that. Start eating more balanced diet. Stop eating junk. You have all the money to take care of yourself. Why do you want to waste your life? Why? Remember, no matter what you want to achieve, this body is the vehicle that will carry you to achieve it. If you don't maintain this body called your vehicle, that's your vehicle, it can carry you to where you want to go. You work virtually 18 hours every day. And yet you don't even spend time to enjoy, your, to enjoy the money you are making. I had to do what? Put exercise in my routine. Why? Because that is what it has. What That's what is required. I don't like jumping up and down in the gym. I jump up and down. I stretch my hand. If you see the kind of exercise we do today, with weights and everything. Mr. Nosa, I like your physique. You look so good as a guy. You look good. Hey, I have to go sweat it out in gym. You want good body, you go to gym. You don't like your body, you go to gym. You value your health, you exercise, you eat well. You want to be mentally ready, mentally sharp and, 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 and strong. Study. Challenge your mind to doing great things. That's the price you have to pay for growth. So how many of you are willing today to pay the price for your growth? This year, let me see where your hand. How many of you are willing? Let me see where your hand if you are willing. Type in the chat, telling me I am willing. Go ahead. Type. I want to see you type in the chat. Let's communicate with each other. Type for me in the chat. Say I'm willing. Type in the chat saying I'm willing. I'm the first to send it. Type in the chat saying I am willing. Type in the chat saying I'm willing. All right. Madam Roda, I've received yours. I'm willing. Yes, Mr. Ayuba Dauda, I'm willing. I've received yours. Yeah, Baba Wale Funke, I'm willing. I've received yours. All right. Thank you so much for listening. All right. So quickly, I'm gonna be um I'm gonna be showing you something very important. Now there's a new project we're gonna be launching um soon. That's be on the twenty seventh. It's called the Wealthy Project. Okay. Now it's called the Wealthy project I'm coming i believe you can see the screen clearly it's called the wedding project okay now this project is uh is geared towards helping us to achieve greatness in our business and to help each and every person we encounter to achieve greatness okay we call it the Wealthy Project. That's that's the uh, the project we have currently.
the wealthy project. Now, what is the wealthy project about? The wealthy project is to help and empower at least this year over 5,000 persons to earn a minimum of 1 million. Now, we are not, I am not going to be making it crazy. I'm very simple with it. Okay? The Wealthy Tribe Project is a project that I and my leaders, my top leaders, we designed to help 5,000 persons. 5,000 persons to earn over 1 million. 5,000 persons to earn over 1 million. That's the goal. Within 12 months, being in this project, you should have made over a million naira. That is so, so easy. People like me make over a million in a month. It's not for people like me, okay? My top leaders, I can't be having this, this project. Their own is not for them to make a million. Their own is how many persons in the 5,000 are they going to be helping to make a million naira? This project is for me. It's for those that want to help people. I want to share something with you that is very, very powerful. Let me tell you. The amount of success you have in your life is directly proportional to the number of persons you can help to succeed in life. Any money is about bringing value. People ask me, sir, how do you get to the point where you can earn millions in this business? It's because, let me give you the secret. I don't focus on myself. I don't focus on myself. Never. I always focus on how I can help you, how I can help someone else. Yes. The secret to extraordinary life and success is living a selfless life, living a life of service to others. So the Wealthy Tribe Project is for you to help people. Take your eyes off making a million naira this year. Put your gaze, let your mind be on helping someone make a million naira this year. Trust me, you will not just make a million, you will make millions. And you will start making millions every single month. Mr. Nosso, give me one secret that made you to earn over 130 million in less than seven years. Very simple. I never paid attention. I never focused on myself. Never. Anytime we design a project, it's about someone else. Now, you can, stick, you can decide to sit back and be the one I'm following up. Be the one I'm encouraging to earn one million naira. Or you can step up to where I am, where I am recruiting people, working on them to earn one million naira. Now, that is the secret to extraordinary success. The kind of money I'm making in the business is extraordinary. It's not ordinary money. If you want to be making peanuts, focus on yourself. You want to make the big bucks, focus on others. How many of you get what I'm saying? If you get what I'm saying, write for me in the chat saying, I got it. Write for me in the chat saying, I got it. Write for me in the chat saying, I got it. You can decide to step up. Step up to a higher life. That's what I call a higher life. A higher life is a life that is centered on others. Yes. That's the reason why I can spend my money traveling around the cities, mentoring, coaching, helping. Making sure that people are growing. Why? Because I don't want to have an ordinary life. I don't want to have ordinary results. I always going for, I'm always going for the extraordinary results. Selfish people only focus on themselves. That's why they live ordinary life. That's why they have ordinary results. Can you imagine? One million, what is one million? One million naira is a chicken change in this economy, for God's sake. So this project actually is not for you. You are the one championing this project for others. You are the millionaire maker. Type for me in the chat saying I'm a millionaire maker quickly. Type for me in the chat saying I'm a millionaire maker. I am a millionaire maker. I am a millionaire maker. The secret to having more in life is giving out more. So when I'm learning, you see me, I read books every day. This is one of the books I'm reading currently. Okay? You see me, I'm reading books every day. Personal MBA. Master the act of building a business. I'm studying. I'm in developing myself because I want to bring value to others. The reason why I'm showing up every day, the reason why when I say let's do this, I'm the first to do it is because 
I want to be a blessing to someone else. Yes. You are the millionaire maker. So please, the Worthy Tribe Project is not for you. The Worthy Tribe Project is for you to empower others. So when I bring you to the millionaire school, I'm mentoring you on how to make others millions, millionaires. Yes. That's the reason why I'm bringing to the millionaire school. Now, if you want to mentor others, John C. Marcel will say, if you call yourself a leader and no one is following you, you're only taking a walk. I will say that again. John C. Marcel said, if you call yourself a leader and no one is following you, you're only about taking a walk. That is why the starting point is learning the art of recruitment. You must learn to recruit people. So I have a goal that I've set out for each and every one of us. And in this goal, I call it the 90 Days Recruitment Project. I'm going to be launching it on Saturday. Now, those of you that be attending millionaires, I will be in Yola on Saturday to launch this project. 90 Days Recruitment Project. Now, this is a project where I want to help you as an individual to be able to recruit 30 persons directly in 90 days. That's 10 persons every month. Now, there are so many gifts I'm going to be giving out to people that will be working with me on this. Yes. So if you work with me on this, the one million naira we talked about within 12 months, you'll be able to earn it in six months. I'll say that again. If you work with me on the 90 days recruitment project, you will not be making one million naira in 12 months. You'll be able to make one million naira in six, in six months. One of the best ways to influence people is to live a life of example. The reason why you can listen to me is because I have credibility. I've earned 130 million. More than that, every member of my family has earned millions in the business. Some of you that came on Saturday saw that. That's the reason why you can listen to me. So one of the ways to do what to exert influence over other other over others is what to live a life of example, an exemplary life. When you've earned a million in six months, you can call someone and tell the person, "See, come, let me show you. This time around, I want to help you first to end that." That is why the 90 days recruitment project is very, very important. Extremely important. 90 days recruitment work project. Very, very important for you to take note of. All right. Let me show you the banner for it quickly. Let me show you the banner for the 90 days recruitment project. Okay. Because we have things we have to do to make sure it happens. Now, that's the banner for the 90. How many of you can see the banner? Let me see. Wave your hand. If you can see the banner, can I see you wave your hand? Sorry. The 90 Days Recruitment Project banner. Let me open it again. If you can see the banner, let me see you wave your hand. The 90 Days Recruitment Challenge. Okay. Now, it's kicking off on January 27. The aim is to recruit 30 partners. I want you to say to me, I'm going to be unmuting you all. I want you to say to me, loud and clear, I recruit... Okay, let me unmute you all. I want to raise your hand and say, I recruit 10 persons and more every month. Okay? Say it after me. I recruit 10 persons and more every month. I recruit 10 persons and more every month. I recruit 10 say it as if you mean it. I recruit 10 persons and more every month. I recruit 10 persons and more in every month. Now, we just have, please just give me only five minutes to share this with you so that I can close the meeting. Listen carefully. If you want to achieve this 90 days recruitment challenge, there are some things you must do weekly. Number one, you must ensure. Let me mute you also that we don't interrupt the meeting with our voices. Let me let me let me close up all. Okay. All right. Now there are three things you must do weekly in order to achieve this 90 days recruitment challenge. I'm preparing you because by Saturday we will be start off. Number one, you must ensure that them persons watch our business video, our business presentation video, which I'm going to be recording between now and Saturday. Don't forget, the project starts on Saturday. Make sure 10 persons watch the video. Don't bother whether they are going to join you. Let them, just, let them just watch the video through you every week, 10 persons. Number two, you make sure that every week, 10 persons attend our live business meetings. Like those of you in Yola, of course, you know what we are working on. Today, I'll be sending you your invitation scripts. The text message you have to send to all the contacts 
over 100 contacts on your name on your list. You are to make sure, don't just send them the messages, make sure that 10 of them attends our live presentation. By next week, by God's grace, we are starting also our Zoom meeting. Then, number three, ensure that you share the business one on one with 10 persons. Now, when we talk about sharing business one on one, some of you think it's about talking like each other. So, no, it's also about watching the recorded video with people and getting them to take immediate action. Now, on the 27th, we'll be launching this project. Now, between now and Saturday, I'm going to be explaining more to you. So, tomorrow, I will focus so much on this 90 day recruitment challenge, explaining to you how to make it happen. Helping you to take steps that will make it happen. So today at the end of the meeting, I'm going to be sending a text message, a message you have to send at least to 100 persons. Those of you in Riola, concerning our business projects, we're going to be having, or training we're going to be having on Saturday. One, sorry, Saturday should be, the time is 12 noon. By 12 noon, okay? It's very important. You know that. Then between now and Saturday, I'll be releasing our business video. And I'll be teaching you between now and Thursday how to work with it. That is why attending the millionaire school is extremely important. So between now and Thursday, because on Friday, I'll be on road to Yola. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, I'm going to be teaching you, preparing you on how to maximize a 90 days recruiting challenge. Those of you that truly desire to make more than a million naira, in less than six months. Don't take the 90 days recruiting challenge as an, uh, for granted. I'm going to try as much as possible. There are some persons in our team that took this project seriously and they earned more than half a million in less than 90 days. I will contact some of them. Some of them are outside the country. Some of them in US. Some of them are in Canada. Some of them are in UK. I will try and contact some of them so they can be in one of our meetings, okay, in the middle of school to share with us their experience. I'm going to say this to you. If you truly want to make it in this business, make it sacrosanct. Never you miss millionaire school. Never. 9.30 a.m. to 10.05 or 10.10. Never miss the millionaire school. I'm going to be sending a recorded video, but if anything happens that you missed it, always go back to the chat, go back to the WhatsApp group and watch the recorded video. Let me say this to you. One of the best things that can happen to you is to be in a group where everybody, where there is a leader, where there is a structure and a system that is going to be working to helping you succeed. Tomorrow also, I will talk about having multiple accounts because having multiple accounts will also enable you to make that one million naira faster. Just in a nutshell. Assuming recruiting 200 persons, sorry, 100 persons, helps you to earn a million naira with one account. It means if you have three accounts, you won't just earn a million naira, you earn Two, 2 million. It means you have seven accounts, you earn 3 million. So multiple accounts enables you to achieve that 1 million naira target faster. So I'm going to be also be sharing that with us tomorrow. So tomorrow, we'll be dealing more on the 90 days recruiting challenge and how we can all earn 1 million naira in 6 months. Nothing more, nothing less. That's what I'm doing tomorrow. So if you are serious about earning a million naira in less than 6 months, then make sure you attend the millionaire school throughout this week and never you miss the millionaire school. Don't forget, our goal is freedom. Our goal is to put you in a place where you are earning financially every single day. But you must be willing to pay the price. You must be willing to pay the price. I want to unmute you right now. Okay? And of course, you know how we, I know how we do it and how we say it. When I ask you what our goal is, you know we're going to respond and tell me what? Freedom. All right? Are you ready for the freedom chance before I close the meeting? Are you ready for the freedom chant? Are you ready for the freedom chant before I close the meeting? All right, unmute yourselves all. Unmute yourselves all. All right. Are you ready? Yes. Our goal yes. is freedom. Some people have used sleep and fufu and eba. So forget it. <laughs> 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 all right so let's go once again mr Fomi francis gonna meet yourself all right let's go once again when i say our goal is what you respond and say freedom our goal is what freedom our goal is freedom, what? freedom. are you ready freedom, freedom. 
I, I wanted to scream it as if you mean it. Our God is what? 